<laughs> Lara, refusing to use the door again, I see. But it's faster this way, Dad. Come here, you little monkey. <sighs> Are you going on another adventure? Yes. My greatest one yet. Well, I've decided that I should be your assistant. Oh, have you? Well, there's no one I'd rather have by my side. But this business, it's too dangerous. Lara, listen to me. Someday, you're going to make such a mark on this world. You're going to make me so proud. Give me a moment, darling. I need to take this. This wound. Echoes of the past. Gather resources to heal injuries. Healing res. Okay, we need herbs to. F oh God. We need herbs for healing injuries. Great. <laughs> so we'll have to collect this these as much as possible because it's the only way we can heal ourselves. We're getting some frame skips here and there. Yeah, let's walk forward, I guess. Oh, hello. Hello, everyone. An abandoned Cold War installation. What the hell is Trinity doing down there? Good enough. Hold V to heal. Yeah, we're gonna have to change these key bindings. There's are not in very convenient spots. More Mongol ruins. It looks like the path goes all the way through. <sighs> Got to get past that bear. Oh yeah. Find a way to defeat the bear. Best laid plans. Got quite the... Quite the setup happening over there. Well, we have to go back up to the bear, but... I don't think we're gonna be able to defeat it. Not with the way we are. Those mushrooms. They're death caps. There we go. I should be able to make a poison. Mushrooms are the answer there. One out of three. Yeah, it wouldn't let me pick up the mushrooms before. I saw the I saw your comment about like um, go back for the mushrooms, but it wouldn't let me do anything with the mushrooms before. But now it will. Hey, we got two picks now. Come better prepared. Yeah, somehow I think we climb slower. Yep, salvage, upgrade weapons, nice. We could grab the rope. Yeah, okay, we'll grab the rope. And we're back where we were before, right? Yeah, I think so. Maybe not. It looks familiar. It looks like where we were before. Yeah. I think it is. I could go that way, or I could come up here. Yeah, the cave. The bear cave. Mmm. You like, I'm kind of thinking I don't want to go in there right now. How do I make the death caps? Oh, I do want to come in here. This is the wrong, yeah, this is the other cave. Yeah. There we go. How do I make it? Make the death caps. Find cloth for the poison arrow upgrade. Well, I will. Find cloth eventually. Not the right, not the right cave. Come back. Here. It's not enough mushrooms. Oh, I just don't have enough cloth. Yeah, that's what it is. I always got a kick out of the fact that she's hanging the glow stick on her butt, but somehow casts a light in front of her with only the faintest shadow of herself. Yeah. Oh, let's grab these two. Stunning cloth. I guess this thing's gonna lead me to where it is. It's 
will be a little bit linear here until we get all that stuff. These characters look Still Mongolian. Mongolian. There's the cloth. I can't read what it says. Return to the camp. The arrow upgrade. Nice. Will do. Once I have the rest of the salvage. There's more. Nice. New things showing up. Again, we're gonna get as much salvage, as much loot, as much like all these resources, hunt animals. We're gonna do as much of that as we can because of Survivor. I just wanna make sure I'm like the best prepared all the time. Okay, let's go. Use the inventory menu to create poison arrows. Ammunition or equipment? Ammunition, please. Silent arrow, poison arrows. Requires two arrows. Uh, it requires uh, one cloth and three of the death caps. Might be able to make something with all this. Okay. Should head back to camp and try. I, I, I am at camp, and I just made it. So, yeah, I think you're right about that one. Mm -hmm. Equipment. Oh man, hunter's quiver. I'd like to have more ammo. That's for sure. We almost have enough cloth. Well, we almost had enough cloth, and then I spent it on the poison arrows. We just have to keep our eyes open for more cloth. We have another skill point. Um, maybe brawler? Take less damage from enemy gunfire and melee attacks. Effect is cumulative with the Heart of Stone skill. Uh, Iron Hide. Take significantly less damage from explosions and fire. Dodge counter. Incapacitate unarmored enemies. An efficient killer. Enemies killed while in stealth will be automatically looted for resources. Yeah. All right. Cool. Stay stealthy, man. Stay stealthy, my friends. Wrap string gives me uh, decreases finger tension for additional hold time. I can do this or I can wait and upgrade the other thing instead or a wrapped handle for this hide wrapped handle improves one-handed grip allowing for dual wielding melee attack combos that knock down even armored enemies Ooh, i don't think i'm gonna run into armored enemies just yet although i mean survivor they might put someone there i think i'm gonna hold the resources temporarily until i can potentially that one Potentially make the hunter's quiver. So I can have more arrows. I don't want to run out of ammo. Stealth is wealth. It's it's the best way to play. It's the best way to play. Alright. So I have poison arrows. Need to rest. So cold. So tired. The whole time on the island you never rested. She's getting old, that's what it is. No, you listen to me. This discovery is too important. I don't give a damn about my reputation. Don't you dare threaten me. After everything I've done? Hello? Hello? Dad, what's happening? They're fools! You're scaring me. I'm close, Laura. Close to something important. Someday, you'll understand. I don't want to understand. I just want you to stop. Be my dad again. They just don't Run shoot at her. Down. Like, what? <laughs> Why didn't you shoot at her? I'm confused. Oh, they can see my fire. They can see my fire. Just blind fire into there, like. 
This innocent camper just he's just doing his thing, you know? Some guy is completely completely innocent of all things, wants nothing to do with whatever you're doing. But he's gonna die now because you're an idiot. Nah. I'm gonna still take this fool. What's the situation? Over. We found another camp up here. Fire was still warm. They can't be far. <laughs> Challenges, grab and go. Loot the corpses of three dead enemies for resources. Well, I already did that, because I have the perk, so he's automatically looted. That's great. Cool. Command, we're fanning out to pick up the trail. Roger that, but it looks like they've retreated. Primary objective is to find the missing... Bye! Oh, I'm gonna like this. Yes, I'm gonna like this. Two out of three corpses looted. I can't pick up arrows. I'm full of arrows. Wow, I'm full of arrows. Poison cloud arrows. Press X while aiming to shoot. Poison clouds incapacitate or stun. X while aiming. Uh, do I? How do I? So X is like my special shot button. Is that it? Hmm. All right. Best laid plan, sneak or fight past Trinity soldiers to reach the cave. Well, we're gonna do both, actually. We're gonna we're gonna fight while sneaking. Okay, we're gonna sneak uh, to fight. Shit. Spread the word. The natives set snares in the clearing. They must have planned for us to pursue. God damn it. They weren't retreating. This was a feint. They're still out there. Brinker's KIA. Someone's gonna have to cut him down. The second guy up there. He's down. So, apparently shooting them with arrows doesn't count. So, if I'm in stealth, but I shoot him in the head with an arrow, that doesn't count as a stealth kill. So, only the, like, attacking him from cover like that does. Okay. Fine. Let's head this direction. Sure, I'm not. I, like, strung this guy up upside down. Why did they do that for? Poor guy. Alright, well, this guy's walking. I'd like to shoot him, but... What the hell? You may have noticed something. Sleep. He was on to me. He saw this body. He had to be stopped. Signal we got said they were under attack, then nothing. That was just a few minutes after the natives hit us outside the ruins. Then they retreated away from the facility. This was a coordinated feint. They're trying to spread us out. We're gonna need counterinsurgency protocols. It'll blow the timetable. Constantine's not gonna like this. But it's better than getting picked off in the dark. I could stealth kill him, but I think the other guy is right by him, right? Yeah, there's two of them. Heads up! Incoming! Does the other guy know where I am now? No, he doesn't. He's out. Lights out. That was quick. Oh, we got another guy over here. Oh boy. He might see. 
He's out. <laughs> long range, man. Long range. That was fun. Let's grab this. Archivist map. Reveal locations of documents, relics, and mur murals on the map. Sweet. So we got locations for everything now, huh? So are the blinking ones the ones that I haven't gotten yet? Is that how that works? It's gotta be, right? Document is here. Challenge is complete. So I've already done all the challenges. There's two relics this direction, which I can't get to this one. I don't think until I can blow the hole and whatever that is. Like, I need explosives for that, I think. Yeah, because this is the cave we're going to go in with explosives, and then they're in here. So I'm thinking that these two documents are the only ones I can actually get right now. I wish I could tell if there were any more enemies, but... It's gonna be fine. Just loot the bodies. Good cleanup work. We're gearing up. I was on the first flight to Siberia to secure the old Soviet installation now. More are arriving every minute. Konstantin gave a speech to the new boots and I stayed in the back to watch. Love hearing him speak. Never gets old. I was never much for believing, but it was just words before. What? Booth. I was broken once. That was strange. But Trinity is making us whole again, giving, giving us a purpose. A new world awaits. Even those who don't believe will have a part to play. That was really weird. I don't know why that happened. Gearing up. Uh, some sort of private journal. One of Trinity's soldiers. Yeah, the Elgato just decided it wasn't going to send a signal anymore. It could be a DX12 thing. I am running DX12. I've been told DX12 creates all sorts of problems, which makes me believe, like, which leads me to say, why are we using it? But I may not use it in the future. We'll see. Isn't it supposed to ha have better performance, though? It does, like, doesn't DX12 give you better, better performance in game? Hi, Big Bear. All teams, How are you? Your eyes open. The natives booby trapped the woods. The natives booby trapped the woods, did they now? Is the booby trap's name Laura? Just wondering, because, uh. Your guy's back there? Oh, shit. Uh, they can see me. I needed to get him before he saw, before he found the body. He was coming to investigate it. Heads up. We haven't restored the uplink. Expect interference on all transmissions. Yeah, he was going to find that. He was going to search that body. Let's grab some more feathers. We're actually full, pretty much full on ammo, because we keep recovering ammo from the bodies we shoot, so. There's something else up there. I don't really want to pick up that canister. Okay, I think I've wrapped up Trinity's guys here. Let's move forward. Not the game bear, sadly. How did I get up there like that? Oh, I went like this. Duh. Yeah. All right, I need to kill the bear. There is. Defeat the bear. I mean, I don't have the, the hotkeys like I want them right now, so I'm not entirely confident in my ability to kill that bear. But, um, I'll give it a shot. Because 
this button being dodge is really, really annoying. What if I can set keybinds differently on the go? Can I do that? Hold on. Let me see if I can set reset my keybindings right now. So this button here... Looks like G is also dodge. What's the key bindings for this right now? Um, options, keyboard and mouse. That's not it. I want gamepad. No, I want keyboard and mouse. But I want the button hints. No, mouse smoothing. Is that something I want? Not sure I want that. No, it's working out okay so far, so I'll keep it. But where? Key binding. Here it is. All right. Tell me what you change things to. So you drop dodge is no longer shift, that's sprint. You added the sprint button, which is great. But drop dodge is now, uh, yeah, G C and G. Interesting, okay. Um, we can probably just do G then. Interact is E, yep, survival skills. E. I like all those. I'm okay with all these. Alternate fire being X is a little funny. Maybe I can change it to this button here. Probably do that. And then healing being v we're gonna pop it over there so this needs to be this needs to be heal and then we have alternate fire here so this is x so v x and then like g i think we'll do that okay let me see about getting my key binding set for this nope wrong mouse there we go all right uh it's key binding so this is not not for tomb raider anymore we want to switch the game to being a different game switch this out change it to uh g games steam library steam apps common uh come to to rise of the tomb raider here exe when this game runs do this mouse profile and the mouse profile will be this button here i'm going to change you to be uh, alternate fire, I think. So I'm gonna go alt fire, and you're gonna be X, okay? Then you are gonna be healing right here. Yep, you are my healing button. And we'll go V, V, v was heal, yeah, V is heal. Go heal. And then uh, this was gonna be my dodge and stuff. So I'll put these two buttons as, uh, instead of two on this, let's change it to be Actually, let's do just the bottom one. I like this one being four as well. Mm -hmm. Yep, indeed. So this one here is gonna be my dodge and my dodge will be uh, C or G. It actually doesn't matter. No, I'll just make it G, it's fine. Okay, yeah, do that. I want that to be the thing. And then sensitivity wise, I think we're fine right where, right where, right where we wanna be. Okay, hopefully that uh, it takes effect immediately, and I don't have to reload the game for it, but I might have to. Let's find out. So if I do this, ha ha! Nice. Uh, that's great. Cool. Um, Jabun, Jabun, Jabun. Thanks for the Twitch Prime sub, man. Appreciate that. It's really cool of you. I appreciate that. Enjoy for the next thirty days. Have ad-free viewing and uh, access to sixteen channel emotes, and you're earning pieces at twice the rate now. Our stream currency. Twice the rate for you. Dog portrait for the new sub. There you go. We'll make that a thing. Free dog portraits for all new subs. There you go. Not resubs. We're gonna do like a tele. We're gonna do it like a phone carrier where, uh, you know, the new customers get like a special perk that existing ones aren't privy to. So free dog portrait for all new subs. There you go. <laughs> Perfect. I like it. All right. So alternate fire should be this button here instead. Okay. Pick up the arrows and I'm nervous. I'm pretty sure we're gonna die because we don't get heat. We don't get to heal. So there's no healing allowed without you know using the supplies you have. Yeah, I gotta pull it out. Poison cloud That's arrows. Press X out. while aiming to shoot. Poison cloud incapacity. Yeah. Hold some time. Go go go.
Bring it, bring it, bitch. Okay, that's not how you do it. I thought maybe that was how you do it. It's definitely not how you do it. Run. Oh, I can't heal myself fast enough. Run! Oh, no. I can't heal myself while I run. I'm trying, I'm trying. Go, go, go. Oh, God. This is a bad idea. What have I done? Very bad idea. Shouldn't have taken on the bear. I can't see him. I know he's right behind me, though. He's right behind me. No, use the poison arrow. What are you doing? No, why? Why? Why did you do the regular one? That's not the button I pressed. Why? Am I, oh, I'm probably out of them. How do I make more? No. How do I make more? How, how, why do I? Wait, why do I have a skill point? Did I have a skill point last time? Did I always have a skill point? What? How do I make more? How do you make more? Like, why you're... <laughs> Become bear poop. I, I know, like, how... How how do I make more poison arrows? I think I ran out of them. All right. Too cramped to fight. You can only have two. Better to draw Perfect. It out. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Hold some time. All the way to the back. Oh, no, you gotta get up and run. Get up and run. Get up and run. Yep, he's uh right behind you. You gotta run. You have to move your, your move your ass. <laughs> You're not moving. You have to run. He's right behind me. How do you turn around fast enough and fire a bow? Or heal, or anything. How do I do that fast enough? He's like right behind me. No, no, what are you doing? Oh, shit. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> No, run! No, that's not how you do it! That's not how you do it! You gotta run! No, you have to get away. You have to move. You have to move your ass and move and move and go. <laughs> Heal, please. Okay, go. Hurry. You only have one more med pack left, so, uh, you know, let's not waste it. <sighs> I'm shooting him! I'm shooting him in the face! Right in the face! That's not in the face, but it's still a shot. Right in the face. Yes, yes. Die, bear. Die. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. That's fun. That was good. I like it. Yes, I want to... Mm -hmm. Bear hide. Yes. Yes, bear hide. All the bear hide. <laughs> Jazz, thanks for the host. Gonna do division with Krios now later. Hey, see ya, man. See ya. Climb the trees if you can. No, I think so. Or maybe it would it have let me? Would it have let me climb the trees? I don't think so. I think you just have to run in circles. Oh, well, it would let me do that, which is not quite the same. But it does let me grab the branch, so I'm thinking like if it would let me do that, then why not why wouldn't it let me hang from it and get on top of it? It like automatically swings me though. I can't like hang on to it. Yeah, it just it's auto. Okay. Well, the bear's dead. So ta-da. Let's go into the cave. See what's inside his cave. You come over to my house and you kick my bear. Hold X to craft poison arrows. Ah, okay, so you just hold and craft two more like that. Nice. That's actually a pretty intuitive way of doing it. I like that. 
Ah, another case. Open it up! Pry it open. Semi-auto pistol parts. One of four. Weapon parts. Pry open strong boxes to reveal weapon parts and upgrade tools. Uh, collect all parts of a weapon to unlock it at base camps. Interact. Bust through the wall. Carton fans here. Well, hello, man. How are you? Oh, we got another scroll thing here. The fugitive prophet has crossed out of the Empire and now turns north. I'm now in unfamiliar territory. The Order of Trinity was clear. I am to pursue the false prophet and his adherents to the ends of the earth and wash away his heresy. But I believed I could overtake him months ago. Still, he eludes me. He crosses Khazar land and across the Caucasus mountains. Here, I'm at a disadvantage. I speak a dozen tongues of the Empire, but in the hinterlands, I'm often left to communicate with little more than a sword. The Prophet, it seems, speaks every language, as if he were born to them. Northern Passage, the tracker followed the Prophet into unfamiliar lands. And he seems like he's starting to admire the Prophet a little bit. Certainly does have some respect for him now. Could it be... Could the future foretell of him finally coming around and believing he's a prophet himself and following him? Will the hunter become a follower? Best laid plans, Glacial Cavern. Follow the Mongolian path to search for signs of the lost city. Mongolian path meaning, can we learn the Mongolian language now? Maybe. It's not gonna be easy. Damn it. Not gonna be easy. Ice bear. Evening from Southampton, UK. What's up, man? Shit. That's gonna be cold. Yeah, I don't normally stream on Saturdays, but like I really like the idea of doing so more often. I just need to have that be okay with my wife. Arrowhead carved from bone. This looks like Mongol craftsmanship. It's gotta be the tip, right? Yeah. This was a whistling arrow. Ooh. Mongol archers would fire these over their enemies to frighten and confuse them. A whistling arrow? That's so creative. Oh man, that's cool. Yeah, it would be. I would be. You hear like tons of whistles racing over your head, confuse you. Yeah, for sure, it would totally confuse you. Uh, we have Mongolian language proficiency increased. You know what? See, you know what? Finding that arrow probably shouldn't be able to do. Teach you the language, as it's written. Hold R, right mouse to dive. We can go underwater. Cool. Oh, we can go underwater. Yes, yes, we can. Go up. I'll need wood to get this fire started. New base camp discovered Mongolian Passage. Use campsites. Yeah. Oh, use the wood you have to light a fire. I have to use the wood I have? I have to use resources to make a fire? Oh, come on. This level of realism. I wasn't prepared for it. I was just arg- So, the entire last game... I was like, this is so unrealistic, all these things she can do. And now I'm like, appalled by having to use wood to make a fire. <laughs> GG, well played. <laughs> Skills. Let's take a look at, uh... Uh, hunter and scavenging is probably pretty useful. Animal instincts, animals glow, maybe scavenger, animation courses, eh, maybe. Eh, death, breath control. Increased steady aim, time to on bow uh, charge shots. So I can hold the bow longer, it's probably useful. Or we can go into survivor again. 
and find challenge objects more easily in survival instincts. That's probably good because then I can I can highlight the challenge objects. Yeah, let's do that. I want to be able to get the challenge object. Oh, it looks to me like there's a weapon upgrade we can get for the bow. Yes, gripped. Um, so faster draw speed or wrapped string. Longer hold times or faster draw speed. Looks to me like we can only afford, we can almost afford both. Very close to being able to afford both. Or we go with a wrapped handle and we get improved leveraging for increased prying speed. Eh. Now we're going with this. I'm thinking the faster draw is more important than the longer hold for now. So let's do that. We almost have enough. We need one more cloth and then we can get the wrapped string as well. So that's cool. That's sweet. 